you look for one person? Yeah, right now. So you can make us everybody in staring at Catherine over here at the Bacchanal Buffet at Caesars Palace. Okay. Now the Bacchanal Buffet is open Monday through Friday, 9 to 5. Okay. Now the Bacchanal Buffet it's self-serve. There's a few new additions like a hot dog dim sum cart and lots of more new vegan and vegetarian items. But of course, it's all about the seafood and meat. Mm -hmm. And in today's video, we're going to be eating all the seafood. And all the meat. Why you can beg us? They've got shrimp, cocktail, snow crab legs. And these are lobster claws. We've also got oysters on the half shell and sea scallops. Jonah crab claws. They've got ten toe mussels and Cortez clams. You want to start with some of this? You want to load up a plate with a few of these items? You want lobster, yes? Yes, please. Okay. There's a claw. Take one or two. This will take two. Okay. That's a very claw -y. Oh, That is good. <laughs> now, can you show the lobster bit soup this evening? Yes, please. Yes, please. Thank, Thank you. you. Got Thank lobster you. bits. Enjoy. I can get another cup so I can add more lobster into my... You sure can. <laughs> Thank you. So? Thank you very much. Thank you. Perfect. Enjoy. Thank table you. side lobster bisque. They pour it for you right there and you can even ask for extra lobster. <laughs> There's just this much inside so you might want more. Right. I do. Right. And it's lobster and butternut squash. Oh, that's which right. Is kind of nice. All right, I'm gonna start with this lobster bisque. What are you gonna start with? I'm gonna start with the lobster claw. Oh, that's a good idea. <laughs> There's lobster meat. Oh, look, it's shaped like a little lobster. Can you see this? No. Oh, look at that. It's, the butternut squash is cut out in the shape of a lobster. Come on. How cute is that? Okay, go in. Okay. That is the right amount of lobster. Oh, good. You good. can put more in. You can put, put yours in. in. I could, I could put in my chilled lobster claw. Mm. Okay, here's my lobster claw meat. Try it right now. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's like for real lobster. Mm -hmm. mm. It's so good. <laughs> I gotta try it. Now, now I almost have too much bisque here. I wanna get to the real lobster. Mm -hmm. mm. This is real lobster too. Mm. All right, I'm gonna try this. This is a real lobster claw right here. Mm -hmm. And what are you going for next? I'm gonna go for the Jonah claw crab oh, next. That's right, the Jonah crab. Right. right. They, they look like very close to the stone crabs. I think the last time I had uh, a lobster like this was probably at the Valley Sterling Brunch. Those oh, are lobster right. tails. Or the Silverton right. used oh, to right. have a, a lobster <laughs> all-you-can-eat buffet. That's right. That's right. Both of those are amazing. Okay, here, look at this. Ooh. That is a giant piece of lobster. It is a giant piece of lobster. All right, here we go. Like cartilage on the inside. Yeah, this is my Jonah claw crab. I can feel the cartilage inside too, so I'm mm. making sure not to eat that. Oh, I have so much seafood. I'm going to try the mussels. Actually, I didn't try this first round, but I thought I'd give these a try now. Yeah. I'm going to try these shrimps. Okay. Mmm. Those are good. Mmm. Mmm. Mussels have a really nice seasoning. I like those a lot. We got two. Yeah, this cocktail sauce is perfect. Now it's my turn to try the lobster bisque. I'm going to add our extra lobster and butternut squash 
two of my first bowl here. The pro move is to definitely ask for a second bowl to get a little more meat. Yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. Mm. That is really good. That's a must get for sure. And they bring them around mm -hmm. in the dim sum carts. They also bring around uh, hot dogs, Wagyu hot dogs. Mm -hmm. Japanese right. style. Yeah, and the Japanese style, yeah, they have like mm -hmm. Japanese toppings. In mm -hmm. fact, I see it right over there, it's coming. How are you doing tonight? Good. good, how are you? I'm good. Can I just you and try the Japanese Wagyu beef hot dog tonight? Yes, yes please. please. Japanese Wagyu hot dogs are here. We had these in our first visit to the reopening of the Bacchanal Buffet. Mm -hmm. We're having to get this bun is so good. I know, it's really nice. It's like a lobster roll bun or something like that. Yeah. It's really good. And of course, you never want to fill up on bread at a buffet. But this is worth it. It's a good one. It's a small bite too. It's only a couple of bites. I'm gonna have a crab leg now. This I didn't have it the first time, surprisingly. There's so much to eat here. There's so much the to eat. There's so much to eat. I'm just gonna pinch off this piece here off the cartilage. Yeah. Mm. That is a very good snow crab leg. Mm. That's really good. You're gonna finish your hot dog? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna have some scallops. These are excellent scallops. I really like these. You had those last time. We're I here did. for the first time the of first the reopening <laughs> of the box yes. and all. The chilled sea scallops. Sea scallops. Excuse me. Here we go. Mm. Mm. That's so good. It's really just, I feel like having a really good sashimi. It's delicious. Mm. Oh, so good. I have to get two. I'm going back in. You can get two hot dogs. You can also get or as two many hot as you want. It's all you can eat. <laughs> True. There is a lot more to eat on this buffet, and as you can see, the seafood is definitely the most popular section. There is a, a line here I need to get into in order to get this seafood. So here we are in the line. Looks like they have the barbecue oysters, and this is cedar plank salmon. Oh, and this says sweet corn chowder with lump crab and garlic cheddar croutons. Definitely want to try this one. Okay, thank you. Thank you. It's the red curry shrimp and grits. This looks good. Huh. And turmeric grilled baby octopus. Get one of those. And the Frito Misto. And I'm already, <laughs> I already got my full plate here. What have you got? I pretty much have the same thing you got. I feel like I have one more thing. Oh yeah, you got oh you got the plank salmon. I did, I got the cedar plank salmon. Let me try first. I'm gonna try the octopus first. <laughs> I love octopus. It's even weirder looking on the bottom. Alright, you ready? It's like is it like a head and everything? Yeah. Okay. Alright. Oh yeah, I guess I should cut it into pieces. Cut the head off. There we go. All right, this is the more man today. Oh wow. Super tender. That's it. Really tender. It's smoking. Mm -hmm. The sauce is excellent. All right, this is the curry with shrimp. I mean, that is curry. It's like a, I don't remember what the sign is. <laughs> Maybe some kind of curry, shrimp, and grits. That's really different. I love grits, but I've never had them with curry flavor. That is so good. Mm. All right, time for some meat now. 
I see there's a steamship wagon. Is it tight? It's the closest thing to Kobe beef. It's real good. It's a little rest right here. Hi. I'd like to try I'd like to try that as well. It's funny we were just watching your YouTube channel. Oh were you? Yesterday. <laughs> and we're like, okay, we're gonna go. <laughs> Thank you. Oh that's awesome. So Is this like a rotisserie chicken? Oh yeah, I see it says rotisserie chicken. Yes, that would be great. Thank you. And I gotta get some of these ribs. Gotta get the ribs. These were my favorite when I first came back here to the, the all new Bacchanal. Oh, it looks like the chicken and waffles is a hit because it's all, and the cheeseburger bow. Neither one is here right now. Those were both really good. All right, this is the, that's the rotisserie chicken. This is the American Wagyu steamship. And these are the ribs, the St. Louis ribs. These were my favorite when I was here on opening day. But who knows, maybe this will be my favorite. Let's give it a try. It is wag. Catherine is back as well with... I am back. <laughs> looks like all the Mexican food. I did. I got almost everything I didn't get the first time I was here. And You got I, corn, though. You definitely got that last time. Yeah, and, but I didn't get the other flavors. Oh, right. Yeah, there's yeah. like all sorts of flavors you can get. Right. They have a classic elote uh, Mexican treat style corn you can get. You can also order hot Cheetos and Takis. Mm. song, everybody. <laughs> So I got the hot Cheetos and Takis here, you can see it's on either side, and then I also got roasted garlic with a very, very light dusting of cilantro. Yeah. I asked for light. She's not crazy about cilantro. Okay. She actually hates it. <laughs> but, he said to try it, so I'm going to try a little bit here. I love it. Yeah, that doesn't look like too much cilantro for no. you right no. there. No, no, In fact, there's a little on this one too. I guess they just they put it on that one. Yes, a little bit, because like, this is a roasted garlic, roasted garlic and cilantro with the cotilla and crema. This is the, you see flaming Cheetos and Takis on here. Well, I, I gotta try this steamship Wagyu. Mm -hmm. Let's see, it lives up to the hype. I'm gonna try the hot Cheetos and Takis. Okay. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Which we like. Ready? Here we go. Mmm. That is so melty tender. Really? Oh, like, good. This has definitely got to be the best of all the carved meats here. Ooh. That was the Wagyu steam chip? Yes. Mm. This is delicious, by the way. I didn't say. <laughs> yes, okay, thank you. Thank you. The Flamin' Hot Cheetos and the Takis together. It's, mm. We can get a bite with both of them. Highly recommend. This is excellent. I highly recommend this. Very different things. The, yeah. Very good. Ooh. Definitely. I can't wait for you to try this. Mm -hmm. You want to try it? Just try this piece right now. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. Maybe can I try the, one of these? Maybe try this corn. Do you want to try the cilantro mm -hmm. and grow the garlic yes. one first? Okay. Yes. And I'll try it. And you try the the wagyu. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm gonna try the wagyu now. Ooh, that was so good. Mmm. Mm. This is good too. Mmm. They're very buttery, a little very cheesy, mm -hmm. and garlicky, very garlicky. Yeah. Mm. I guess I'll have to go back and get a second one. Mm -hmm. You can try this one. There's only like two bites left. It's all you can eat. It's hard for me to turn this over, but there's like roasted garlic right here along the bottom, you could potentially just roll it in it. I don't know if I want to try it. It's not too hot. All right, I'll try the hot corn. I'm not a fan of flaming Hot Cheetos, but we'll see. Okay. It's pretty good. Yeah, right? <laughs> right. It's hot though. But it's good. Starting to kick in. Ooh, the roasted garlic one is so good. I gotta get my ribs. Oh my god. That's what I've been dreaming of. 
St. Louis ribs. I have so much here on my plate. Those ribs are also very, very tender. Mm. That's why I love them. Barbecue sauce is great, a little smoky, a little sweet. Mm. But man, this wagyu. That's really good. That's really incredible. I'm gonna have to go back for my own meat plate. Yeah. After I work on this. Yeah. Have some more of this. You're very welcome. Hey, Joyful. Thank you. What is that? This is the pozole rojo in the Mexican station. Okay. Mm hmm It looks really good. Big chunks of what, pork? Yes, big chunks. It's great. Okay. Really big chunks. Good. It looks like a homemade, mm -hmm. you know, broth and mm -hmm. everything. See the hominy? Yeah, hominy. Mm -hmm. Pork. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's so good. It's very soothing. Do you want to try some? Yeah, I guess yeah. so. Let's try the broth. Maybe a little hominy. Yeah. Actually, I got a little piece of pork. Even better. Mm -hmm. That's good. Mm -hmm. I think I prefer the, the lobster bisque. Now I have got to get some of this Chinese food. This is some of my favorite food. Well, just in general, but especially on the Bacchanal Buffet. They have egg rolls, sesame balls, some crab rangoon, oh, and this carbonous duck. I didn't try that last time either, so i got to try it now. We're in the sushi section. They've got eel. This is eel sushi. I want to get one of those. I think this is the Vietnamese fried fish. That looks popular too. Now they got a lot of vegetarian items, salads, like really interesting concoctions, like this parts of palm roll. I'm gonna try that. I gotta get some greens at some point. And how about some some charcuterie? This is what I should get, right? This looks like uh, kind of a uh, prosciutto. Yeah, so a little bit of prosciutto. Maybe I'll put the prosciutto on this, this vegan salad. The hearts of home vegan salad now with prosciutto. Here's the pizzas. Margarita pizza. This is a thicker crust than they used to have here at the Bacchanal. If only they had spaghetti. All right, so what do you got here? It looks like a whole variety of food. Well, I got one vegetarian item here that I added prosciutto to, and I also got this the uh, some mostly this Asian food. It says chicken and gobo. That's the Szechuan fish, crispy beef, uh, eel roll, eel sushi. Uh, not a roll. It's a eel nigiri uh, sushi. And duck. So this is the shakshuka that was in the Mediterranean section next to the Italian section here. There's a small egg in tomato sauce and it comes with a bit of bread to serve for dipping. I'll try my vegetarian salad. <laughs> with prosciutto? Yes. I'll try just the hearts of palm first. Okay. Mm. It's like a dill. It's like a real dill. Oh. Leap thing. Now I'm going to try the crispy polenta. There we go. This is like making like a lettuce wrap. Mm. Mm. Is that good? Mm -hmm. I like this one. This is yummy.
It's good? Mm-hmm. Mm. That's the move. It is? Adding meat to the vegan items. <laughs> You're going to get the falafel? I'm going to try the falafel first. How about okay. that? Yeah. That's very good falafel. Right, now going in on the, the fish. I'm gonna try the beet hummus. Yeah. Mmm. Good. What does it taste like? It's just the way I like my fish. Sweet and crispy. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna try the beet hummus now. I'm not. Wild about beets, but we we'll give this a try. And that looks like it has some crispy garbanzo beans up top. That's nice. Mmm, this beef is good too. The crispy beef? Oh, I'm gonna try that for sure. It's also sweet and crispy. <laughs> it's all crispy beef. For a reason. Beet hummus is good. Um, I do definitely taste the beets. So it's a bit beet forward, obviously. But if you really love beets, that's for you. Now I'm going to try, these are the, some of the other vegan things I, I picked up. I'm going to try the mojito watermelon now. This is like a little refreshing bright. This is by the carving station. You wouldn't expect it by there. It's adjacent to the whole suckling pig. It's like a palate cleanser. It is right? a palate cleanser. That's how I look at this eel as well. Like <laughs> there is no time. Dessert. It seems like that's on everybody's minds. But there are plenty of desserts here at the Bacchanal Buffet. Including, there's a crate station, one of my favorites. I've always enjoyed the crates here. Made the order. Okay. You can rest it as you like with some mixed blueberries. Well, we I have it. I came prepared. You can also put bananas foster oh. in. I think I'm going to put just a little bit of bananas foster. Good. But yeah, that looks great. And some whipped cream. Right there. That's a crazy. Why the crazy? Yeah, there's lots of other desserts. Look at these little, uh, what are those bugs called? Ladybugs. Oh, yeah, ladybugs. <laughs> I guess it's the cupcake for the ladies. Oh, there you go. Okay. All right, we're going to take the lids <laughs> off these desserts. It's almost there. It's almost there. There you go. Okay. <laughs> Phew. You got a, quite a variety of the desserts there. I got this little uh, pistachio creme brulee, but the main dish right here is this crepe. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's phenomenal. It's I have a tiramisu, which yep. I didn't see before. And speculoos cheesecake. Ooh, yeah. Speculoos. Mm -hmm. Strawberry shortcake with a little edible flower. It's like a little bucket. Yes, I love it. It's a little bucket with a little pail. I love it. So cute. A chocolate coat of creme. I believe this was like a salted caramel mousse or pudding. Yeah. That looks great. All right. Got mixed berries, bananas, foster, a wall of whipped cream. Ooh. That's right, there's chocolate. Almost forgot right. I asked for chocolate <laughs> sauce inside, too. <laughs> I'll wait for you. Go okay, ahead, you can start. Oh, okay. There's a chocolate coat of creme. That's okay. That's the mm. Japanese Wagyu hot dog cart. <laughs> I, well, we, you know what? I had one already, but I love those. Can I have another one? Thank you. <laughs> Topped with seaweed and kewpie mayo. Mm -hmm. 
Pickled Thank ginger. You. And the pickled ginger. Look at that. <laughs> and what? It's like a sweet teriyaki. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. It's a sweet Thank teriyaki. You. That must be what makes it so good is that secret ingredient. Yeah. The chocolate pot de creme is delicious. It's a really nice, like a chocolate mousse. Okay, but I like the chocolate shavings too. It's a little small portion as well, so you have a never beat all the other desserts. Mm. Oh boy. Mm -hmm. First of all, there's so much going on in there. Okay. Because it's like the bananas are getting coated in the chocolate. So it tastes like a, you know, chocolate coated banana instead of bananas foster. But then there's berries, so it feels like a chocolate coated banana with a berry sauce on it. And then there's whipped cream, so it's super creamy. And then the crepe. So you have that wonderful pancake-like base. Mm -hmm. I love this. He's very happy at the <laughs> I got a hot dog to eat after this. <laughs> okay. Now that I've tried the chocolate pot de creme, I'm going to try the Speculoos Cheesecake, which I've never seen on a buffet before. It's a Speculoos Cheesecake. This looks and sounds delicious. Let me get a pencil. While you're going to work on the crepe, I'm going to try this. You love that cookie dough, cookie butter, speculoos oh, yeah. flavor, made famous by Trader Joe's. I like create cookie butter flavor. The speculoos flavor is so spicy and warm and cinnamony. It's great in the cheesecake. Again, I am not, I love sweets, but I'm not the biggest fan of cheesecake because I don't want too big of a piece. So this is just the right size for me. This is just the right size for me. <laughs> Next, I'm going to try the salted caramel mousse or pudding. I can't remember the exact label. I'm going in. I would ask you how your crepe is, but I know you love it. It's great. I know. I got to slow down. I want to. I want to try this one. This is yes. a pistachio creme brulee. Was that it was like a that? creme de pistachio. Creme de pistachio. Okay. It's. I love this. Looks good. It's like right. pistachio flavored, like a like a creme brulee mm -hmm. or a flan or something mm -hmm. like that. Mm. You, know, you love pistachios. I love pistachios. That's so nice because you don't really get mm -hmm. a dessert that's like all pistachio. Okay, back to my crepe. Right, this is the salted caramel mousse or pudding, and you see as it's nice. These are the layers there. You see the mousse and the caramel top. And these, these sprinkles on top for texture and crunch. I still have more dessert teeth. I'm going to try the adorable strawberry shortcake in a little pail. I got another one. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I can see there's like a strawberry mousse. You can see the cake underneath it. There's a little edible flower too, which I think is adorable. Strawberry shortcake. It does look good. Can I try that? Yes, you can. That's good. Get some strawberry too. Mmm. Well, that is good. It's really good. The tiramisu, that's the uh, Italian uh, espresso kind of flavor, mm -hmm. uh, cream mm -hmm. dessert. Mm -hmm. I can see that there's, there's like an espresso soap lady finger underneath. You see it underneath there. Let's give it a try. Yeah, you can see there's a one lone espresso soap lady finger underneath. Usually it's layered, but right now it's just one in here. Try. That's really good. <laughs> so creamy and that espresso <clears throat> flavor is really strong and it just pairs really well with the creaminess of the custard. You'll like this. You know, I just realized that this crepe, the way I have it all basically put everything on it with the chocolate inside, it tastes like a banana split. Oh! 
right? Oh, the banana, yeah. chocolate, strawberry, that. whipped cream, and the whipped cream. Yeah, so minus, you like, minus the ice cream. Yeah, just no. Uh, but they they have gelato. I can put the vanilla ice oh. cream or vanilla gelato on here. You it could. would totally be a banana split. Oh. Why did you? Yeah, I know. I should get that. But I gotta get the strawberry mousse, and I gotta eat this hot dog. <laughs> Japanese wagyu hot dog. It's all you can eat. There is more Asian food down here. They've got soups. It's an Asian soup station. Udon noodles, tonkatsu, ramen, Vietnamese style, miso soup, and sour soup. And it's all made to order. Right here, you can see the stock. Hi, how are you? Thank you. Can I try some Udon noodles? Uh, two katsu ramen, please. Two katsu ramen. Ramen. Thank you. Udon is a dashi broth with tempura shrimp and kamei boko. Kamboko? And then your tonkatsu ramen is a pork broth with chashu and bamboo. You have the ramen in it. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Ramen, thank you very much. Here's your ramen. And then my udon. So she's getting some, some stuff on her knee, the balls in the back. Awesome. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right, this is what I call the perfect Japanese meal. I've got tempura, shrimp, udon, and a Japanese wagyu hot dog. <laughs> I have tonkotsu ramen and some sushi. Yeah. All right, so what sushi do you have here? I have the tuna. I have the salmon nigiri, I have the spam musubi here. We have the table set, spam musubi, we have the unagi. And we have what was called, I believe this is called the spicy tuna crunch roll. All right, try this broth. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna try the noodles first mm. on this ramen. Mm, yeah, the dashi broth, mm. green onions. There are a whole lot of noodles in this bowl, mm. by the way. Oh boy. Let's try the noodles first. Mm. Those noodles are incredible. That's like real ramen. Yeah, real ramen, and the, they have a really nice texture and chew. And yes, I know you. I need to chop this, but right now I'm using my fork because I didn't have to. Did have I didn't see I any. I, I think I saw some, but it's okay. We have forks. That's okay. We have forks. I know how to use chopsticks. Yeah, I know. This. I know how to use the forks. <laughs> so how do you like the new Bacchanal buffet? Oh, we love it. We we came when it was open. And now it's open again, so thank God. Yeah, so what's your favorite thing so far? It looks like you just oh, got a couple of big things. The crab. We even make our own finadeni from Guam. So. Wow. That's even better. Cool. We'll see you. Awesome. Nice to Tell me, what do you think? What is the best thing you've had here at the new Bacchanal Buffet? Love, love the, the lobster quads. Good addition. Yep, love absolutely. Uh, the little carts coming around were kind of cool. Right, the, uh, right. Uh, lobster pit. Lobster pit. Did you get the hot dogs? Uh, not yet. Oh, you gotta try those. They're like Japanese wagyu hot dogs. They're really good. Thank you. Thank you. I really like the crab and also yeah. I'm like gluten tolerant and he came out with this dessert. Do you still have it? It's Anyways, like, a, like a sunny side, side egg. Like yes, the sunny yeah. side of egg. Yeah. Bone marrow. Wow. Yes, it's gotta have that. Favorite. Um, And their dessert bar, you just can't stand. Excellent. Awesome. Well, so nice to meet you guys. So nice to meet you. Now the great thing, oh, they even have a horchata, piña agua fresca, I know, a guava agua fresca. Yeah, I'll have to come get some of these, but first, we're on our way to get seconds of some of the things we like. That's the great thing about a buffet. It's all you can eat, which means if you find the things that you like, you can go get more. And what we like that we're going to get more of is the meats. Hello. Hello. How are you today? Welcome to Bacana. Thank you. Good luck. This 
are the this is the roasted bone marrow, remolada, pickled onion, galoche bread, and this is the wood grilled lamb T-bone. It's even got smashed peewee potatoes, rosemary miso, and pink peppercorns. This is what it's all about right here. Prime rib, and I want to try that. This is the American Wagyu Steamship. This is, I'm, I just had some and I'm back for more. I want to grab a marrow now. Have you guys tried the brisket yet? I have not yet tried the brisket. Are those ribs? Are those like some kind of ribs over here? Thank you. So what kind of ribs are these? Are these, these are beef, beef ribs? Beef ribs. Oh, okay. Yes. From the beef. Perfect. Thank yeah. you. Can I please yeah. get some wagyu and brisket, please? Thank you. Thank you. All right. I am going in on this American wagyu. Oh, that's right. I did not yet try this. So. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Heard very good things. Mm -hmm. mm. mm. <laughs> this makes me happy. Mm -hmm. And we got beef ribs. Carved right off the prime rib. <laughs> that is an awesome look of beef rib. Right. Astounding. Look at this. Astounding meat. <laughs> mm. Mm -hmm. mm. No talking. This might be my favorite mm -hmm. of all. I've got to say mm -hmm. that. Wow. Wow. Mm. You know, because it's so close to the bone, so tender, but also all this char. Mmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Mm. It's so smoky. Yeah. There's a lot of really good flavor, not just mm. on the outside, but on the inside as well. Mm. Yeah. Ooh. It's heavy. It is heavy, yes. Feel a bit like a and the Flintstones with this. Mm -hmm. mm. Wow. Belgian chocolates, Alfonso mango. Hello, how you doing? Hi, how are you? Uh, do you recommend a particular one that everybody loves? I love the Oreo cookie. Oreo okay. cookie? Okay, I'll try that one. What's good? Uh, yes, please. And maybe I can try the, like the strawberry <laughs> sorbet as well. Oh, it's good. Very refreshing. Good? Yeah, thank you. Strawberry. Same cup, Same cup is fine. Hey, did they offer? Can I please get Thank the you. mango sorbet? Yes, ma'am. And also the green tea gelato. I have not tried it. Same cup is fine, too. They've got green bay, and espresso chip. That's the green tea, okay. and that's the strawberry yeah, cheese. Okay. Can you get them? Yes, great. Thank you very You're much. You're welcome. Thank you. I like these uh, waffle desserts. Mm -hmm. Here's the sunny side up egg, which is so good. Yeah, so this is the, it's literally called the sunny side up egg. And it's sweetened yogurt, mango, spear, and vanilla powder. Look at that. <laughs> it's like... I can't tell, I don't know if you can tell like how much that looks like a little egg yolk, but it's mm -hmm. a mango spear. Yeah, and it tastes like mango. Mm. Ooh. This is a really nice dessert. Mm -hmm. It's it just looks so cool, but it tastes so great. It tastes, yeah, it looks really neat. It tastes even better. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Mm. And you get the vanilla hint from the vanilla powder on top too. Look at this tiny spoon. I love the tiny spoon. Now 
I got strawberry sorbet. Okay. Mm. And some Oreo gelato. I have green tea sorbet and mango gelato. Mm. Which one is it? This has got the strawberry. Ooh, okay. Mm. <laughs> I love green tea. I know, I love strawberry. Mm. Mm. Strawberry and green tea also go well together. It's true. Mm. Rainbow cake. Rainbow cake. It's just layers of cake with it. Six layers, all different colors. Maybe you have the jam filling, apricot jam. Oh, it's very soft, like a sponge cake. Right? Ooh. Okay. Mm, really light. The cakes itself don't have a particular flavor, but the filling, the jam filling does. And that's really nice. It's a nice thin layer. So it's not like orange flavor, lemon flavor, lime flavor, no. blue flavor. No, no blue flavor. <laughs> no. It almost seems like these are almost like vanilla cakes with just a light layer of jam in between. That's really nice. It's, it's just very simple and pretty. Very pretty. So the Bacchanal Buffet at Caesars Palace. It is back and it is full of meat and seafood and dessert, just about everything you could possibly want. Vegan stuff too. So if you're interested in any of that, be sure to come check out the Bacchanal Buffet. It's not cheap, $70 per person, but I think it's worth it. Hey, thanks for watching everybody. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Leave a comment, let me know what you think about the Bacchanal Buffet. And be sure to subscribe for more because there's always more to eat when it's all you can Vegas.